There was at that position a 13th magnitude star. Which is unbelievably bright. Unbelievably bright. In the vast expanse of our universe, mysteries abound. We peer into the night sky, scanning the infinite ocean of stars, galaxies, and cosmic wonders. But there are always things we cannot see. Things beyond the reach of even our most advanced telescopes and the capabilities of our brightest minds. But sometimes, just sometimes, the universe surprises us by revealing something so unfathomably incredible, so bewildering, that it changes our understanding of what's possible. This is one of those moments. What if I told you that astronomers have discovered an object so bright that it defies everything we thought we knew about the cosmos? An object so powerful, it shines 500 trillion times brighter than the sun itself. That's right, 500 trillion times brighter than the heart of our solar system, the star that sustains life on Earth. It sounds like science fiction, but it is very much a reality. And today we're going to dive deep into this discovery and what it means for the future of space exploration, our understanding of the universe, and potentially even the future of our own existence. But first, let's set the stage. The Sun is already an incredibly powerful force. It has a luminosity, a measure of brightness, of around 3.828 times 10 to the power of 26 watts. In other words, the Sun radiates an extraordinary amount of energy every second, lighting up our solar system, providing warmth and sustaining life on Earth. But despite the Sun's colossal power, it's just one of countless stars in the vastness of space. In fact, Many of these stars are far brighter, far more massive, and far more energetic than the Sun. These stars can be found scattered across galaxies, some located hundreds of millions, even billions, of light years away from us. And in recent years, astronomers have identified objects that defy imagination, shining with intensities that are almost beyond comprehension. Now imagine an object that doesn't just rival the brightness of a star, Imagine something that is 500 trillion times brighter than the Sun. Such an object exists. But before we explore what this object is, let's talk a little bit about how we made this astonishing discovery. In recent years, astronomers have been using cutting-edge technology to peer deeper into the universe than ever before. One of the most important tools in this quest has been the study of quasars. Quasars are incredibly distant and exceptionally luminous objects that are thought to be powered by supermassive black holes at the centers of galaxies. They are the brightest objects in the universe, emitting more light than entire galaxies. But while we've known about quasars for some time, the discovery of this specific object has completely rewritten the rules. The discovery was made by an international team of astronomers who were studying a distant quasar located over 12 billion light years away from Earth. This particular quasar, designated as J1007 plus 2115, is located in the constellation of Virgo. It was detected using some of the most powerful telescopes available, including the Keck Observatory in Hawaii and the discovery is already being hailed as one of the most significant astronomical finds in recent history. The sheer brightness of J1007 plus 2115 is what caught the attention of researchers. The object was emitting an enormous amount of radiation, far more than anything astronomers had ever seen before. After analyzing the data, the researchers realized that the energy output of this quasar was not just remarkable, it was outright terrifying. To give you a sense of scale, if we could somehow move J1007 plus 2115 into our own galaxy, it would outshine every star in the Milky Way by an unfathomable margin. It would be so bright that it would cast shadows here on Earth, a blinding beacon visible even in the daylight. But it's not just the luminosity of this object that makes it so extraordinary. It's the mechanism behind it. To understand why this object is so bright, we need to look at the core of quasars and the role supermassive black holes play in their formation. At the center of a quasar lies a supermassive black hole, 
often millions or even billions of times the mass of our Sun. Surrounding this black hole is a swirling disk of gas and dust known as an accretion disk. As matter spirals into the black hole, it gets heated to extreme temperatures, emitting enormous amounts of radiation. This process is what powers a quasar's incredible luminosity. In the case of J1007 plus 2115, researchers believe that the supermassive black hole at its center is actively consuming vast amounts of matter, releasing energy at an unprecedented rate. The radiation produced by this accretion process is so intense that it has the potential to outshine entire galaxies. The amount of energy being radiated is simply staggering. But what's even more remarkable is the fact that this quasar is located 12 billion light years away. The discovery of this object is groundbreaking for several reasons. First, it challenges our understanding of the early universe. J1007 plus 2115 was formed at a time when the universe was still in its infancy, just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. The fact that a black hole of such massive size could form so early in the universe's history is a puzzle that researchers are still trying to solve. Secondly, this discovery could have implications for the study of supermassive black holes. We know that these giant black holes reside at the centers of most galaxies, including our own Milky Way. But the exact process by which they grow and evolve over time is still not fully understood. Objects like J1007 plus 2115 provide a rare glimpse into the formation and development of these enigmatic cosmic giants. Now, you might be wondering, what are the potential consequences of discovering something as bright as this? Can an object so bright be dangerous, even though it's located billions of light years away? And could we ever be in danger from a similar object in our own galaxy? The radiation emitted by quasars is incredibly intense, but it is also spread out over vast distances. Even if a quasar were to be located much closer to our galaxy, it would likely take millions of years for its radiation to reach Earth. And by that time, any potential effects would be minimal. In fact, the radiation emitted by quasars is not likely to cause any immediate harm to our planet. But there's no denying that objects like J1007 plus 2115 push the boundaries of what we thought was possible in the universe. As astronomers continue to study this remarkable discovery, it opens the door to new questions about the universe's earliest moments. Could there be even brighter, more powerful quasars lurking out there, just waiting to be discovered? Are there other objects that challenge the limits of physics as we know it? The truth is, we still don't have all the answers. But one thing is certain. The universe is far stranger and more awe-inspiring than we could have ever imagined. And discoveries like this remind us of just how little we truly know about the cosmos. In the years to come, as technology continues to advance, we may uncover even more objects that are brighter, more energetic, and more mind-boggling than anything we've ever seen. The quest to understand these cosmic wonders is just beginning. And who knows what new secrets the universe will reveal to us next. The discovery of an object 500 trillion times brighter than the Sun is a stark reminder of how much there is still to learn about the universe and the forces that shape it. Whether we are witnessing the birth of a new generation of supermassive black holes or simply catching a glimpse of the universe's most extreme phenomena, one thing is for certain. We are living in an era of unprecedented astronomical discovery. As we continue to reach further into the cosmos, we will no doubt encounter even more jaw-dropping phenomena. But for now, the discovery of J1007 plus 2115 stands as a testament to the boundless wonders of the universe and the incredible ingenuity of the scientists who are working tirelessly to unravel its mysteries. So the next time you gaze up at the night sky, just remember, the universe is far more terrifying beautiful and unfathomable than you can ever imagine. And who knows what mind-bending discoveries still lie waiting for us in the vastness of space, the dawn of a new era in astronomy.
The discovery of J1007 plus 2115 is more than just a singular astronomical find. It's a glimpse into an entirely new era in the study of the cosmos. However, this rapid formation presents a challenge to our understanding of how black holes can grow so massive so quickly. Typically, a black hole forms when a massive star collapses at the end of its life. But this process usually takes millions to billions of years. The formation of supermassive black holes in the early universe may not have followed this typical path. The high levels of radiation and the rapid consumption of surrounding matter suggest that these objects could have formed in a very different way, perhaps through the collapse of larger and denser gas clouds. It's also important to acknowledge the technological advancements that allowed for this discovery. It's thanks to the sophisticated instruments we now have at our disposal that we can study these far-off cosmic objects in such incredible detail. The Keck Observatory, for example, is one of the most advanced astronomical observatories in the world, and its ability to capture light from such distant sources has made discoveries like J1007 plus 2115 possible. The next generation of telescopes will allow us to study even more distant objects with greater precision. The James Webb Space Telescope, set to launch soon, will be able to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths, which will allow us to peer deeper into the cosmos than ever before. This will undoubtedly help us understand more about the origins of the universe and the forces that shape its evolution. The connection to dark matter and dark energy. As we push the boundaries of what we know about quasars and supermassive black holes, we are also presented with opportunities to explore the mysteries of dark matter and dark energy. These elusive phenomena make up the vast majority of the universe's mass and energy, yet they remain largely invisible and undetectable by traditional means. Could the discovery of objects like J1007 plus 2115 help us understand these cosmic puzzles? It also highlights how much more there is to discover. As technology advances, we will continue to uncover new objects, phenomena, and mysteries that challenge our understanding of the cosmos. While J1007 plus 2115 is certainly an extraordinary discovery, it is by no means the end of the journey.